Johnny Cage. The amulet. Enjoy the new digs, Gramps. Sonia? Johnny... Did we...? Yeah. We got him. Remain here. The Chamber's properties will heal Sonia Blade in short order. Quan Chi and the others, they're gone. A surge of power within the chamber overwhelmed my senses. We can deal with Quan Chi later, Kinshi. We've netted a bigger prize this day. Shinnok's amulet. And within it, old Fishface himself. Let us take the amulet to the Elder Gods. They cannot destroy it. No one can. They might offer counsel. Shinnok can never escape. The war is not over. Quan Chi has escaped. Why are you smiling? She called me Johnny. Raiden told me later that I'm descended from some Mediterranean war cult. Bred as warriors for the gods. I've never been able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. <laughs> How about you, Cassie? Can you summon anything like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur. Or Iran. Or Kurdistan. Did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin monks ever send you there, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. F At ease. You're all here because you deserve to be. You're beautiful and unique snowflakes. Now, as I'm sure you're unaware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six-week anniversary. Secretary Blake says he's pleased with our progress. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with our progress. He was smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. As the secretary pointed out, us older folks are gonna retire someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin, Shirai Ryu, SF, together. For your team's first mission, you're going to the Lin Kuei Temple. We haven't heard from the Grand Master in a while, so we need to make sure he's still on our side. That he's got our backs if things flare up again with Outworld. You need to bring him in, but don't be surprised if Sub-Zero's not willing to cooperate. Why be worried about Outworld? I thought Kotal Khan respected the Reiko Accords. He does, but he's facing a civil war. The Rebels win, those Accords will be history. The expression it's not worth a dirt on my shoe. Kotal Khan has always bargained with you fairly, you know. Sure, sure. I'm just saying. Upgraded weapons, my intel, and poof. The long outworld civil war. Done. Might be nice to kick back a bit, eh? You know Melina's location. And a whole rebel army. It's got to be worth at least 50. I must attack her immediately. End this conflict. As you say, it drains us. Right. Do we have a deal? What is it, Devora? The Emperor should not be concerned. Accident ahead. This one will clear it.
Make way for Cotton Cat. Move! The Tarkatans are in position. We await your order. It is given, dearest Tanya. Stopping a carriage is nothing. Killing an emperor... False emperor! ...requires power. Power you have, Melina, and won't use. It pains me to use it, Rain. I need more time. The usurper's excursion came too soon. The rain falls when it may. No matter. If Kano does what I paid him to do. Now! Do it! You said a mouthful. Million. Melina's given me twice that to take you out.
You're not worth the dirt on my shoe. I'm pleased you remember me, Koata. I will never forget those who freed Melina. She vowed to create a free Edinia, something you refused to do. A united outworld stands strong against its enemies. It will never be united under your rule. Your rebellion is all that prevents it. Fool to trust Melina. She tasks me for the last time. Melina. Kano was to kill you, miserable snake. Another Adenian, the supposed half god. I am a son of Argus. I was not merely declared a god by befuddled commoners, Bulak. Uh, uh. 